Uh, here, uh, CRS uh, was founded Yasuko Kasaki in 2004. And then here is a healing and art center. And we have uh, uh, many classes, art show, uh, workshop, and performances, music. Uh, today's guitarist is uh, Mr. Yoneta. Thank you very much. And sometimes a film screening and also gallery exhibition. And but more than that, uh, many people uh, come to hear uh, meditation practice <coughs> and also um, uh, spiritual learning uh, based on the book, textbook title is A Course in Miracles and teaching by also Yasuo Kasaki. And today I'm very proud to introduce to artists uh, Yuki Hoshi and Gustavo Kui and they are learning the apples and miracles here. So as you see their uh, photographs, I want to say of course photographs are taken by camera of course but in their case I think their photos were taken by their mind itself. So, I don't know how to express <laughs> my feeling, but maybe you understand. And so uh, tonight, uh, we are uh, Mrs. Yasuko uh, Kasaki joining us, and they are talking about healing and art, art and healing. So after this uh, artist way, uh, please stand in front of those pictures and please find who you are. Thank you very much. Um, thank you very much for coming uh, and sharing this evening. And uh, thank you, Yuki-san and Gustavo. You created uh, this opportunity and uh, offering uh, us this opportunity. And especially Gustavo. Uh, we asked you to prepare everything uh, very quick and uh, without any time you did it. So I've been learning here that time doesn't really exist. I guess I could make it. <laughs> the restaurants were really busy too, but I was able to yeah. pull it off. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> so, um, there are Japanese friends here, but uh, tonight uh, let us talk uh, in English uh, uh, basically. Uh, should we talk in the Portuguese? Portuguese? <laughs> I think I can help it. Okay. So, um, this exhibition, duo, duo exhibition, uh, we named uh, Reflection. So, I named Reflection, actually. So, and, uh, I have a responsibility to explain about this title and to do so. Let me decide. It's um, short, uh, our gallery statement. So. Um, this exhibition by Gustavo Curry and Yuki Hoshi, despite coming from very different parts of the world, Yuki Hoshi is from Japan and Gustavo from Brazil. These two artists share a common background in video. Curry is an award-winning documentary filmmaker and uh, Yuki Hoshi worked for 10 years in TV production before turning to ceramic art. And each, however, finds time to publish a popular photography blog inspired in part by their common practice of meditation and study of a course of miracles. The works presented here reflect the meditator's mind as much as the mind of the artist. They look at earth and sky at their own mind's reflection, rather than carefully manipulating the subject to compose these photographs, the artist simply observed, recognized, and enjoyed. Henry Cartier's Bresson said, a photograph is neither taken nor seized by force. <coughs> it, offers, sorry, it offers itself up. It is a photo that takes you. One must not take photos. 
So they know such various and beautiful shapes, colors, light, and movement are their mind abundance itself. They record their perceptions with deep gratitude and a sense of wonder. So a uh, pioneering photographer, Edward Steichen, uh, he's a, probably, I can say, the first fashion photographer. Uh, once you really commence to see things, then you really commence to feel things. So these words show us that we can be grateful to be in the world of duality. We can always see ourselves as blessed, beloved beings whenever we remember our reflection. Stand still in front of each photo and find who you are. So we live in duality, meaning uh, we have to see something. We have to, I have to see you to know myself. So we see sky, we see us, we see everything and to know ourselves. But um, this case, um, let me talk a little bit more just by myself. I know both artists. I know you guys very well. And uh, I know the uh, common sense in them. Number one, patience. Number two, generosity. And number three, sense of wonder. Sense of wonder, in other words, innocence. And more accurate to say, uh, they are free from fear of showing their patience and generosity and uh, innocence. You understand what I mean? Um, as you know, these qualities come from only tranquil, meditative, sane mind. So if you have the uh, mind of excitement and impatience and judgment or chasing safety, chasing security, chasing pleasure, you can't see. You can't show patience, generosity, and innocence. So it can be said that they are reflection, their works are reflection of their quality. So they don't see the sky, nor earth, nor light. They see the, their mind on the sky. Then they receive their reflection as the, uh, with a gratitude and with a appreciation. So that means the reflection. And um, plus, uh, I like to emphasize, when artists see um, reflection of their mind, at the same time, they know it's not only their own mind reflection. It's a mind of all of us. That's why artists know it. the works have to be shared to get the meaning. So works themselves have the uh, destiny and the responsibility to be shared. So then we now have the uh, responsibility to join the offering. So, and uh, I think this is a very fair attitude as the artist, and also I think it's a fundamental attitude as the artist. It's fundamental, and, and yet, we tend to forget. But uh, I appreciate you guys never forget. Thank you. And, sorry, I just talking and talking. But, uh, so now I start the interview. Um, do you know what day is today? Today is the one year anniversary, Michael Jackson's passing away. And did you notice uh, Yuki's work, of Yuki's work, the beautiful sky, it's the uh, sky right after he passed away. 
So, and Yuki, uh, 